so in this video i'm going to be showing you guys a car to rc merge so you're going to be able to put benny's wheels or f1 wheels or whatever wheels you want on your rc bandito so in this video i'm going to be putting uh, my f1 wheels on my rc bandito so just go ahead and get inside the car that you want to um, put the wheels on your rc bandito and just hit right on the d-pad to take it inside of the workshop and you don't need to spawn inside your bunker or any type of session you can do it in any session it doesn't matter and also like i said you don't need to spawn inside your bunker so once you come in here you just want to go ahead and change one thing on the vehicle i forgot to do it but i'm just going to go back inside the um, car and just change one thing about it so probably change like either the license plate or like the windows it doesn't have to be anything expensive so just go ahead and change like the cheapest thing on the car So once you've changed something in the car, just go ahead and get out of it. And when you get out, just go ahead and call either Ron, Simeon, or Gerald and request a job from them. So I'm doing it with Gerald, but you guys can do it with Ron or Simeon. Hey, what can I do for you? Alright, so once you've got the sure. job, you just want to go ahead and I'll go to the first person. And just walk up to the RC Bandito, but not too close, just to the point where it gives you the option that says hit right on the d-pad on it on the upper left from there just go ahead and go back into third person open up the job like this so just go ahead and click on the jobs open it right now i'm just deleting the jobs the extra jobs that are on the phone so just go ahead and open up the job like this from here all you want to do is just hold down your pause button as soon as you let go of pause you want to click a and you're going to hear a little click in the background so just go ahead and open up the job and when you open up the job just hold down your pause button as soon as you let go of pause hit a and you're going to hear a little click in the background when you get the option menu up, just go to online, go to jobs, play jobs, rockstar created, go to the missions, and start up a titan of a job. Now when you get loaded inside of a titan of a job, all you want to do is just go ahead and quit the job. And as soon as you quit the job, you just want to go ahead and spam right on the d-pad. So as soon as you load inside of a titan of a job, just go ahead and quit it. And as soon as you quit, just spam right on the d-pad. And you're gonna get it like a little like flashing screen and then you're gonna see the stuff from the car transfer over to the RC Bandito now if you don't get it in your first try or your second or your third try don't quit it's gonna take a while it depends on how lucky you are I guess because I, it took me like about 30 minutes maybe to do it and in those 30 minutes I wasn't consistently doing it I would stop to like go get something to eat or like be on my phone and then come back and do it so if it's not working you can also try and switch sessions and try doing that or any every time you fail it you could just go ahead and go change something on the vehicle and then come back to the rc bandito and then try it again so if you don't get it your first try don't just say the glitch doesn't work or that it's patched or whatever you just got to keep on doing it and then it's eventually going to work so if the glitch doesn't work like i said you could try and switch sessions or like find a new session and i was actually about to quit the um this video to record a different video i was going to record a modded outfit for the male characters but you just gotta keep on doing it until you get it if you really want your wheels to transfer over to your rc bandito so like i said just go ahead and um change something on the vehicle go into first person and make sure you've already called either lester ron or simeon and requested a job go in first person to your rc bandito just to the point where you get the option that says hit right on the d-pad on it and then you just want to go back into third person and then you just want to go ahead and open up your phone open up the job and you just want to hold on your pause button and as soon as you let go of pause you want to click a you're going to hit a little click in the background go to online go to jobs play jobs rockstar creator go to missions and start with titan of a job when you're inside titan of a job you just want to go ahead and quit it and as soon as you quit it just spam right on the d-pad and then hopefully your stuff transfer over to the car and also if lester is um spamming your phone with invites you just go ahead and disband your mc or leave your ceo because if you're a ceo or a motorcycle club president it's gonna keep spamming your phone with a whole bunch of job invites so just go ahead and leave your um ceo or disband your uh, mc and if you guys want to see the part where i hit the glitch it was at a 10 minute mark so just go ahead and skip over to the 10 minute mark and you're gonna see the part where i hit the glitch and i'm gonna give you guys one more tip i'm just gonna wait for um this part to get out the way so i can show you what i'm talking about what can I all right do? so um all right he's not right here so just wait hold up just a little bit longer all right so this part right here when you get a click and you go to online and you go to jobs 
and you go to play jobs and you go to rockstar create and you go to missions when you hit a title of a job so when you get this alert right here you just want to wait three seconds before you actually accept the alert so that's just another tip that you guys can do to try and get it a little bit more consistent so when you click a title of a job and it asks you do you want to start it just wait three seconds before you accept it all right so in this part right here also when you leave the job you just want to go ahead and wait three seconds before you accept this alert right here so i'm slowing it down right now so when you um hit b to leave the job just wait three seconds before you accept that and as soon as you leave just spam right on the d-pad so those are the few tips that um i'm trying to give you guys to help you hit the glitch and also remember like i said i probably said it multiple times already but switching sessions also helps if you can't seem to get the glitch to work i think i only switched sessions only twice though so it shouldn't be that big of a deal so like i said already if you want to see the part where i hit the glitch just get to the 10 minute mark What's it going to be? What are we doing? So right here is where I was able to get the glitch. I'm just going to go ahead and change something on my car real quick. I think I changed the window because it was one of the cheapest in here. 
but yeah i'm just gonna go ahead and change one thing on my car i'm gonna get out of it i'm gonna go in first person walk up to the rc bandito till i get the alert that says hey run a d-pad on it i'm gonna open up my phone go to the job open up the job hit my pause button and as soon as i let go of my pause button i'm gonna click a and then i'm gonna go start me tying up a job and then i'm right here like i was saying just go ahead and wait like three seconds before you accept the job and when you accept it when you load in and when you click b to leave just wait another three seconds and as soon as you leave just go ahead and spam right under the bag So as you can see right here, the stuff from the F1 car has transferred over to the RC Bandito. Now to save your RC Bandito, just go ahead and change one thing on it or it's not going to save. So just go ahead and change one thing on your RC Bandito. And yeah, that's the glitch. So if you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to drop a like on it, share, subscribe, and don't forget to turn your post notifications if you don't want to miss out on any other videos. Good.